assemble your scuba diving gear. Coming up next. Hello everybody, welcome to my channel, Never Do All LT here with another scuba diving video. Today I'm going to show you how you can assemble your scuba diving gear so you can get ready to hit the water. Here's how it's done. You're going to need your regulator, your cylinder, and your BCD or buoyancy compensator. So here we are, like I said, regulator, cylinder, and BCD. What you're going to do, remove the cap out of the cylinder neck. Always make sure that the cylinder has an O-ring right there because if it doesn't have the O-ring there, air is going to escape and you're going to lose air sooner than what you're supposed to. Put the strap there. And this, like, uh, this BCD has like a strap here. You can put it around the neck of the cylinder. That way, it doesn't go any further than you need to. is more or less even with this part of the cylinder. Before this is really tight. And right there, it doesn't, it doesn't move because you don't want this to slip while you're in the water. And it's time for the hook of the regulator. Always the second stage goes on the right side of you. You're usually gonna find your regulator with the dust cap on like this. So make sure you unscrew the dust cap and goes like such. Then the inflator hose for the VCD. Make sure it does the click and come off and this is uh, the octopus uh, this is in case of emergency your body uh, runs out of air or, some, or something else happens this is what you're gonna offer so that they can, you can share air out of the same cylinder goes into the octopus holder that way it's not hanging and causing you entanglement into anything and this is your primary second stage and this is your gauges and when you put your jacket on like I have it here clip it here so it's not hanging either so there you have it then you turn your cylinder, your air on. See, you have to make sure that it's really on. Turn it on completely. You turn the valve completely on all the way. And uh, I used this tank the other day, so you only have right now a thousand pounds, but you gotta make sure that uh, it goes all the way to 3,000. And there you have it. That's how you assemble 
your scuba diving gear. Always make sure you and your body check each other's equipment to make sure that everything is assembled correctly. And when you're in the water, always take a couple of breaths out of your regulator because sometimes, if for whatever reason you forget that you turn the air off, they're still gonna have you're still gonna have a couple of breaths out of here, and you might think that the air is on. So always take a few breaths on the surface of the water to make sure that you have plenty of air and you are ready to hit the water and have fun. So this is the video I want to do. Now you know how to set up your school alarm gear. And I'll see you later in the next video. It has been Never Too Aussie. Happy diving.